So let's now connect our Laravel app to our database. We have installed the MySQL. So if I type here MySQL on our server, okay, we have to provide the username as root and then also the password which is one two three four five six for this time so show databases so you can see we have this database we have so now let's now create a new database so create database and this database name is tutorial okay tutorial that's great but uh, again my mistake uh, we have to provide semicolon before pressing the enter okay so it is done and let's now exit from here and let's go to var www.html and i will open dot env in vim so vim is good go to insert mode by pressing i and database we have created just which is tutorial and then username is root so root and the password is one two three four five six so escape colon wq and everything is good this means if i say php artisan make auth it will create authentication scaffolding this means now we will get login and register buttons here so refresh and yes we have so now let's register new user here so sarthak here then sarthak at bitfumes.com one two three four five six one two three four five six and click on this register button and we have this okay unknown database i have misspelled the database so open in vim go to database name i think you have spotted this problem okay so not a big deal and let's refresh once more okay so it says user not exist this means we have to run php artisan migrate this will create these tables and now if i run send this once more and yes we have successfully logged in this means everything is good so here if i go to my sql okay again root and then password is one two three four five six so show database and this time i know we have to provide the semicolon and ah databases and then we have this tutorials database so the last thing remains is that let's connect the database with our sql pro because we have the habit of viewing the database on these kind of platforms so, so let's name it tutorial and give the ip address here and then root the mysql username and then password is one two three four five six then database name tutorial and standard port 3306 again ip address and comes the username and the ssh key and again that has to be the secret one not public one and the port is 22 connect and you can see we have successfully connected and we have this sarthak at bitfumes.com this is the user we have created on our server so in this way we can connect it to database on digital ocean server so if you have learned something from bitfumes if you want to donate just go to patreon.com and become a patreon even one dollar a month can be a huge help for me because your help will encourage me to do these cool steps to help you guys so if you have not subscribed go and subscribe to this channel and don't forget to like bitfumes on facebook twitter and instagram till then bye bye